Hey guys, uh, today I'm going to be showing you how to um, sort of create scripts for Arma 2, kind of, uh, it's more of an IED script tutorial. I'm um, going to show you how to take that IED script that I'm sure you've seen from uh, other videos and put it into an actual script that you can execute in-game. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to open Notepad and you're going to want to type this in. Bomb1 equals EO GBU of GB um, get select Okay, so now you've got this, and this is going to be the script, so you probably recognize this from the other tutorials that you've seen, um, and with this, you have to, you can change this to this part right here to whatever name you want, but this right here has to be the name of the car, whatever you put right here has to be the name of the car. Uh, that you want the ID, the IED to blow up. Um, so I just use car one. It's easy. And what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go save as. Um, you can really save it anywhere. Um, but you're going to all files. You have to save it as all files and then IED.SQF. So save it as that. I already have this saved, so I'm not going to save it. Let's close that. Okay, so here's here's our script. And then what we're going to want to what you're going to want to do is you take this script and you drop it. You have to copy and paste it into the mission folder that you would like this script to be in. So I've got um Missions, so you go to Documents, Arma 2, your missions, these are all my missions that I've either downloaded or created. Uh, and here's here's my mission that I that I have the IED script in. So you just copy it and paste it right into the so it's our script. Copy and paste it right into the mission thing. Then all you have to do is execute the script in game and I'll show you how to do that in a second okay guys now we're uh, in the Arma 2 editor and I'm going to show you how to um, use the script so I'm going to load my mission okay so basically what we have is a convoy and they're going to move through uh, these this IEDs and an ambush. So what you're gonna have to do? That's not this one. This one. Um, access A and Access B can be whatever you want. Um, the activation is just which side you want to activate the IED. So if you're if you want it to blow up um, blue four, then set blue four, and same goes for the other ones. Or you can set it to radio alpha and you can detonate it by hitting the radio alpha but I have it set to blue 4 um, present timeout type none name IED you don't really have to do that condition this and then so right here right here is how you're going to execute the, the IED script so you're going to hit null 01 space equals and then the uh, two brackets exec vm ied.sqf colon 
Um, and that's it. And now uh, I'll show you how that script is going to work. Enemy truck far to our front. All hold fire. Готов действовать. Right flank, 500 meters. Car and truck. Watch, watch the uh, convoy. Copy. Go for the ID. Ready. Target in sight. There you go. Have the target in my sight. There's the IED. Enemy officer. Two hours front. Close. Enemy missile soldier. And Marine. So that's. Two hour front. Close. Uh, there you go. That's simple. A little easier, I think, a uh, way to do the IED other than typing that long script down here every single time you want to do it. Um, but yeah, you have to make sure that the car that you want to the IED to blow up is named Car One, or I mean, you can name it something else, but it has to be. You have to change the name that I showed you earlier from Car One in the script to whatever you have the name as. Alright, yeah, so uh, that's it, and thanks for watching.